In this video, I am going to evaluate the most important problem from complex integration. So now I am going to evaluate integral sine square z by z minus pi by 6 cube of dz, where c is a circle that is modulus of z is equal to 1. So here it is very clear that it is mod z is equal to 1. So which means that z minus 0 is equal to 1. So this is a circle equation. So this is a circle equation with center 0 and radius 1. So this is the circle equation 1. So this is minus 1 and this is 1 and this is minus 1. So this is x axis and this is y axis. And this is the center. See here this is pi by 6. The singular point here is pi by 6. Pi is equal to 3.14 divided by 6. It is 1.523. So which lies within the circle C. So that is what I am going to write here. So what is f of z? So clearly f of z is equal to this is the sine square z is analytic within the circle C within the circle that is modulus of z is equal to 1. Here the singular point here is here the singular point a is equal to this is pi by 6. So this is 3.14 divided by 6. So the point here is 0 0.523 some, something. So here this is 0 0.523. So the singular point is within the contour C. So within the circle C. Then we can apply Cauchy's integral formula. So what is this Cauchy's integral formula? So f n the derivative at a is equal to n factorial by this is 2 pi i integral f of z dz by z minus a bar n plus 1. So I need this one. So I need this integral. So I am sending these to other side. Therefore integral f of z dz by this is z minus a power n plus 1 is equal to this is 2 pi i by n factorial into f n the derivative at a. Now I have to evaluate this integral. Which integral it is given? So it is given that. See here look at the question that is sin square z dz by this is z minus pi by 6 power 3. 3 can be written as 2 plus 1. So 3 can be written as 2 plus 1. So if I compare what will be the f of z. So here f of z value is equal to this is the sine square z. And see when I compare this one. So a is equal to pi by 6. When we compare this n is equal to 2. So if I substitute here. So this will be this is 2 pi i by what is n? 2, 2 factorial and f 2 double derivative at a. What is the value a? That is pi by 6. So now I need this value. In order to evaluate this one, Lucius Cauchy's theorem. I am going to solve this one. So I have f of z value ready here. I will make a double derivative and substitute pi by 6 there. So f of z value is very clear that it is sine square z. So f of z is given as this value is nothing but sine square z. So if I make a first derivative with this, if I make derivative with respect to z, so this will be 2 sine z and next for sine z this is cos z. So the first derivative is nothing but 2 sine theta cos theta is nothing but sine 2z. And now see the double derivative here will be, so this will be 2 cos 2z. And now what is the z value? We have to keep z at pi by 2, pi by 6. So this is pi by 6. So if double derivative at pi by 6 value is equal to 2 cos of 2 into this is pi by 6. So which is equal to 2 into cos this is pi by 3. That is 180 by 3. So 260 that is cos 60 degrees. So this is nothing but 2 into half. So if I cancel this one, the value here is 1. So this is double derivative but pi by 6 value is equal to 1. So if I substitute the same thing here, that is 2 pi i, 2 
factorial is again 2 and this value is 1. So, the value here is pi into i. So, if you observe this one, we have the integral value. So, what is this integral value here? So, according to the Cauchy's integral theorem, we have sin squared z dz by this is pi sorry z minus so this is z minus pi by 6 power 2 plus 1 3 is equal to this is 2 pi i by 2 factorial into f double dash at pi by 6 see here that is 2 pi i by 2 f double dash at pi by 6 value is 1 so if i cancel this one i got the value as pi by pi into i so this is how we have to solve and see this is so simple if you follow these steps so here mod z is 1 is given mod z is equal to 1 so which means that mod z minus 0 is equal to 1 this is a circle equation with center 1 and radius 1 with center 0 and radius 1 so center 0 and radius 1 so this is a circle and see the singular point here is pi by 6 pi by 6 is nothing but 3.14 divided by 6 it is 0 0.52 and this is within the circle c then we can apply generalization of the cauchy's theorem so according to this theorem in order to find this integral we can make we can send these two to other side and this will be the answer if i substitute all these values when we compare with this f of z value will be sin squared z and a is pi by 6 and n is equal to 2 so if i substitute and calculate the second derivative with respect to z and I substitute in place of z as pi by 6. I got this value as 1 and after substituting I got the value final value as pi i. So this is how we have to solve and thank you so much. And if you really like please pass it on to your friends and please practice.